Greenland, the world's largest island, extends over an area more than one quarter the size of the continental United States. Although sparsely populated, it holds the potential to impact populations around the world. The Greenland ice sheet, covering three quarters of the country in ice up to three kilometers thick, would increase global sea level by 7.2 meters if it were to melt completely. Since the late 1970s, NASA has been monitoring the changes in the Greenland ice sheet. Recent analysis of seven years of surface elevation readings from NASA's ICESat satellite and four years of laser and ice penetrating radar data from a NASA airborne mission called Operation Ice Bridge show us how the surface elevation of the ice sheet has changed. The colors shown here represent the accumulated change in elevation since 2003. The light yellow over the central region of the ice sheet indicates a slight thickening due to snow. This accumulation, along with the weight of the ice sheet, pushes ice toward the coast. Thinning near coastal regions, shown in green, blue, and purple, has increased over time and now extends into the interior of the ice sheet where the bedrock topography permits. As a result, there has been an average loss of 300 cubic kilometers of ice per year between 2003 and 2012.
did him, did him, mama No call him rich, yo, yeah, no call him rich bird on a tree I'm just sitting here I got time it's clear to see from up here the world seems small we can sit together it's so beautiful, you and me, we meant to be. 